Good morning, friends. Father Estoc here for our weekly video chat. We are uh, looking forward to a very exciting weekend in the calendar of the uh, liturgy and of Mass, and that is the last Sunday of the year. And we call it uh, our Lord Jesus Christ, King of the Universe. And so it is the last of the 34 weeks in uh, a liturgical calendar, and it is the celebration, the feast that comes before Advent. Uh, Advent is the beginning of a new liturgical year. So with this coming Sunday, we come to the end of the liturgical year uh, 2022, and in next weekend, uh, November uh, 27th, we will uh, begin the liturgical year of our Lord 2023. And on the feast of what we call Christ the King, uh, we are reminded about the effect of Jesus's uh, kingship in our lives. If we could become the disciples of Jesus, therefore we would make ourselves subjects in his kingdom. And like King David before him, uh, and of course, as uh, God has promised from the very beginning, uh, becoming a part of the kingdom of Jesus Christ means being put back together, being put back together with God and being put back together with one another, with our neighbor. And you know Jesus' great command to love God with all your heart and your neighbor as yourself. So the kingdom of Christ has, maybe if you want, a banner or a motto or a saying or a flag, and that flag would be love God and your neighbor as yourself. That's how the disciples of Jesus, the subjects in Christ's kingdom, uh, walk in the world, reconciled with God, at one with God, and reconciled with their neighbor, at peace with their neighbor. Uh, I'm sure in your classroom or in your family, your neighborhood, uh, in many places, you can see that we don't always have uh, reconciliation with God and reconciliation with our neighbor. Um, let's pray this weekend as we are attending Mass. Let's pray that we might grow in our oneness with God and that we might experience that oneness with God by a oneness and love of our neighbor. All right. I hope you have a good week and take care.